I have just told all of them, I disagree with my people, my wife, my children, and we sit down and decide. The reason why I came to this office today is to start that reconciliation because party exists to help in the political process. Our quarreling does not affect the price of Gary or affect the price of beans, anything which the people want us to fight for. So we should not put our energy in disagreeing with each other. People are losing millions of Nigerians don't know where the next year will come from. Mothers are in hospital without knowing how to pay their bills. That should what concerns us. Not this event. And not bringing you people out from your office to come where the sparkling is. No. <laughs> There's a better thing because you're doing a great work for the country. It shouldn't be. We will take it off. That's why I came out today. So I thank you people. And uh, I will also, you are the member. Are you? Yes, sir. I'll see you. <laughs> eh? So please. Sorry, I'm sure we'll make sure that we don't bring you out in this thing. We want to bring you out in something that is better. Where we are talking about your welfare, the future of your children, the future of everybody. I always tell people it is important where we build schools, where your children, my children are in the same school. My mother's driver and me. The children of my mother's driver and me went to the same school. They were actually bright. And that's what we want to do. We want a better Nigeria. Where people will be happy to live. And live their life, especially the poor. Feel their children can become anything. Thank you, sir. 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 Thank on a mission to unite the party to resolve all outstanding issues with the leadership and going by what Obaze said, we'll hear that interview in a moment, it seems that Abure and Co invited thugs to prevent P2B and Co from entering the Labour Party HQ. If that's the case, it means that Abure is just like any other Nigerian politician who thinks of himself alone. He doesn't give a damn about any other person. Even if the house is burning down, he will never sacrifice. It's all about himself and everything about him. Without being told, Abure and the entire executive of the Labour Party were supposed to sacrifice their positions and allow new people to take over so that the party can start afresh and start working towards another general election. But no, he doesn't want to give way. Ordinarily, a party that failed to gain power, the entire executive are supposed to give way for others to try again. Yes, whether they were rigged out or not, they were supposed to sacrifice their positions and make way for new faces to come into leadership so as to accommodate the new members they got because of the main person that attracted all the people to the party. Yes, that's what they are supposed to do. Anyway, let's hear what Obaze said and we'll bring you updates on how the meeting was held, what transpired, what agreements were made, whether Abure will be stepping down. Of course, the NLC continues to insist that a new national convention must be held and Abure will definitely not participate in that convention. Where is Obaze, my friend? Let us talk to one-on-one. -on -one. Let us can't, can't, can't be too mad, people. Yeah, in the place. I came out here. I'm not armed. Yes. Uh, yes, yes. So if I don't trust Everybody you, there, if, if I don't trust you, people, I won't come yes, out here. Yes, yes, okay? Yes. If I don't trust you, people, I won't come out here. I'm not yes, armed. Yes. Okay. I was in a meeting. He spoke to me. Yes. Okay. And he agreed to have a meeting. Yes. What we need to do, we need to finish a meeting. Yes. Eh? Bring your leadership, not yes. just you. The no, meeting, I told him. The meeting is going to be with him. Yes. Alone. We need to resolve this issue. Okay. Anyway, forget about this thing that is happening. Okay. At the end of the day, what we want is a solution to save this country. Yes. And we are all in the same business. That's it. Regardless of where we came from. That's it. So please tell the people to come down. I will go in there and also tell these people. Yes. You know, the funny thing about this thing is that it takes only one person to throw a stone. Yes. Then another person will reply. Yes. After a while, you don't know where the crisis started. I can assure you that. that now, now, nobody will reply to them. First. Two things, two things happen. You didn't know his number. 
but he answered the call. I know. I and, have his number. Okay, yes. and he said this is Peter. Yes, Obi. yes. Fine. I was sitting there and I said, okay, call the leadership. So, the, everybody, every team has a leadership. Yes. So please organize your people. We we'll finish that meeting. Even if we don't, we have to meet here. We we'll go somewhere. Come on. But we will meet. Yes. Yes. But we want to meet here. Yeah. You understand? Yeah. 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 Yeah.